Hey guys, this video is going to be a little bit different. In this one, I'm going to show you how I am polishing up all these epoxy projects. We're going to use this pen as an example. For anybody that likes polishing, you're going to love this. For everybody else that normally likes that I skip over sanding and stuff, you're going to see a lot more of that. But it'll give you an idea of what I'm doing on some of these projects when the camera's off. First, we're going to start by sanding our project down. I start with 150 grit usually and move all the way up to 600 grit. You really want to make sure that you're paying attention to your first grit because if you don't get everything out during that first sanding, you're going to have streaks and lines and imperfections through the whole entire thing. And as we're going up in grit, we want to make sure we're getting all of the scratches out from the previous grit. Once we've gotten to 600 grit with the dry sandpaper, we're going to move over to wet sandpaper and I'm going to sand up to 1200 grit. Once we're done with the wet sandpaper, we're going to move over to the micro mesh pads and move through all of those grips, doing the same thing, making sure that we're getting all of the lines out from the previous grip before we move on to the next grip. Once we're done with our micro mesh pads, we are going to use some mother power plastic restore that's meant for headlights. This is the newest step to my polishing process and it really does make a big difference. Once we're done with that, I add some renaissance wax onto it just so that you guys can see where we're at on the way before we take it off and move on to our buffet portion. I set up our buffing wheels. I like to leave the pin blank on the pin mandrel so I can have a little bit more control over it as I move through the steps. I use the compound that I got in the buffing wheel kit, so I'll leave that in a description down below. So if you guys are interested, you can go and pick one up. But once we get everything buffed out, we should be all good to go. I just make sure that I'm taking my time here and finishing up any little imperfections. And this is what we're left with. If you guys like this video, please leave us a comment down below, give us a like, and consider subscribing. Thank you.